High levels of radiation have reached Tokyo following the accident at Japan's Fukushima nuclear plant. People in the capital have been told not to drink tap water. The country's struggle to resolve its nuclear crisis has again been stalled, with workers at the Fukushima plant evacuated after black smoke emerged from one of its reactors. RT's Igor Agorodnev is in the Japanese capital. Another setback for the shutdown operation at Fukushima. Workers had to be withdrawn once smoke began billowing from one of the reactors for a fear of contamination. Now, this time, it's reactor number three, perhaps the most dangerous of the lot because it operates on plutonium. Plutonium has a much longer half-life than uranium, and if it were ever to get out into the environment, there would be a very expensive and very difficult clean-up operation. This, of course, Mars what has been a um, last few days of very steady progress. The engineers have now managed to connect up all of the reactors to some electricity. In fact, electricity has been restored in one of the control rooms. Uh, they're saying that if this operation continues successfully, despite the recent setback, that eventually they'll be able to put the cooling systems back into action. And the cooling systems will now then cool the rods, and therefore any immediate risk of contamination will then have been avoided. Here in Tokyo, the dangers of radiation are coming from different directions. First, it was the vegetables and the fruit which were produced in the area near Fukushima, which were becoming contaminated. Now, the authorities are saying that the levels of radiation in the water are also rising. And now, uh, babies and small children have been banned from drinking tap water because the levels are apparently dangerous to them. Apparently, it's okay for adults, but at the same time, I'm doubting that a lot of people are risking it. And in fact, if you go into the shops, the bottled water is still going at a very fast rate. So people are not risking drinking water from their taps. There is a lot of rain which has been falling here over the last few days and it's been dropping, if not significant, but noticeable levels of radiation. And we've been walking around the city measuring the radiation levels. In some of the streets, it's higher by five, six times than it's supposed to be, even though the overall indicators are normal. Nevertheless, the authorities are asking their citizens to stay calm.